Hi guys, welcome to my channel Beauty Made Easy. In this video, I will show you how to use this wheat ad removal cream. I was so bored of using trimmer for over 5 years and I thought I would try wheat ad removal cream. I have used wheat already like before 5 years. After I discovered this trimmer, I never switched back to wheat. Uh, this is the By Feather King trimmer. I have used this half of my life. It has a permanent blade. It is operated by a battery. It is a wheat ad removal cream in the sensitive variant. I bought the sensitive variant because I am using it after a very long time. Previously I was using the normal skin variant in the pink color. The package has information on how to use it, patch test procedure and manufacturing information. So now let's open this wheat box. The box looks cute. Anyway that doesn't matter we are going to use only the cream. Inside it has a manual again on how to use the ad removal cream. It also has information on other variants or flavors of the wheat ad removal cream. The cream is in tube form. It also has the same information printed at the back side of the tube. It comes with its own spatula which is very good thing. Pretty in pink. Now let's see how to use them. This is how my arm looks right now. I have air growth. It is not that long but it is quite long to be removed. So let's apply the cream. The instruction says to wait for 5 minutes before removing the cream and not to exit beyond 10 minutes. So let's put the timer on. It is 3 minutes now. I can clearly see my ad dying. It's time to remove the cream. Hmm, it's smooth. My skin feels really soft and it feels moisturized. It is nice and quick. If you are new to hair removal creams, buy the sensitive variant. Use it and see if it doesn't give any skin reactions. So far, I have not experienced any skin irritation of that sort. It is perfectly working fine with me. I will leave the link in the description box if you are planning to buy online. Thank you. Bye. Do subscribe to Beauty Made Easy for more such videos. Thanks for watching.